Hello everyone, this is Jack from Dr. Priest app. Today I'm going to show you my new project, which is the Lexus RX 450H. I've been start working on it since this morning and I already taken out the battery. Uh, amazingly, the entire procedure to remove the panel, remove the seat, remove the battery cell, is very, very similar to the uh, Highlander. And that Highlander is a 2007 and this Lexus is 2022. So I guess there's not a lot of innovation right there. There's a pretty much the same thing. Well, at least on the good side, it's very easy to repair. So in this video, I'm just going to show you an idea of how to remove everything, include the battery. So stay tuned. Okay, so just like the 2007 Highlander, this car, first thing you need to do is taking out the seat. And it is actually the most difficult part because these seats, although all the bolts are similar to, uh, or exactly the same as Highlander, the bolting position are exactly the same as Highlander. However, they are freaking heavy. <laughs> they are leather seat and they have airbags. They have a lot of harness, not a lot. But uh, they have, I don't know, the uh, seatbelt warning light or something in there. Maybe a uh, heated, heated seat as well. So taking out this seat, it, it's a two-man job. I did it myself but because I took a time and slowly moved the seat away from the car. And once you have the seat removed, it's basically exactly the same. You, you peel up the, uh, the carpet hold it in place, and then remove this metal case. This metal case is hold on by a lot of bolts, 10 and 12 millimeter. And you simply just take them out one by one. Very, very straightforward, all right? Once you have that, carefully remove all the harness. There are a lot of harness that was connecting to the battery itself. I already taken it apart. Once you remove all the harness, all three battery will be easily taken out from the car one by one. All right, and here they are. One, two, and three. Now what I'm going to do is transfer all the harness, all the wiring from the uh, nickel metal hydro battery to the next cell lithium battery. These cases are 3D printing. Each case took about 48 hours to finish. Actually, no, 72 hours, three days to finish. And I'm really looking forward to see how the Elysian gonna supercharge the battery system on this brand new RX 450H. And this nickel metal hydro battery, it's about 39 to 40 pounds, okay? And each one of this Nestle Elysian battery is 19 pound. So it is less than half of the way of the original uh, Toyota battery.
It looks like everything's connected. Let's fire out the car and see what's up. Super fast installation. Take like three minutes to finish. Awesome. Of course, don't forget the service block. Here we go. And this is the um, the pack fully assembled. The metal case is on. And of course, see the layout? These three are exactly the same size. But for Highlander, the middle one is small. The, the side one are much bigger. So actually, actually this, is, this is an improvement from Toyota, right? This is the uh, easier to manufacture. You just need to manufacture three exactly the same battery module in order to fit in. All right, firing out the car for the first time with the lithium prototype. Dr. Precept. Here we go. Fire right up. No air coat. There's a oh airbag because I unhooked the back seat. Back seat still not on yet. Um, let's take a look. Watch the difference. Is that's okay? Zero point two. That's very small. Temperature is cold out there. Yeah, everything looks awesome. The standard procedure. Let's check for air cools. Special feature: read battery error. No error. Read engine error. All good. And that's it. Battery fully charged. Everything good. <laughs> and it's raining outside, so that's wait for the rain to stop, so I could take this brand new Lexus out to do some test, run some test. Stay tuned. And that's it for now, folks. It's 3 a.m. on January 1st, 2022. I'm super tired right now, but, but I'm super happy as well that this Lysian is working great on the RX 450H. In the next video, I'm gonna show you the uh, lot of tests, including the zero to 60 test, EV range test, as well as the life expectancy test. So stay tuned for that. Also, I would like to use this opportunity to thank everyone that's supporting us on 2021. We have a great year. We constantly sold out to a level that in the entire December, we have nothing to sell. So in 2022, I'm making a lot of changes, including ramp up the production line and, and also include a new product line for the Highlander RX 400H and RX 450H. So stay tuned for that. Thank you guys. Happy New Year. I'll see you soon on the next video. Cheers.